Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 4067 as a special dedication to Beverly. So we've got 22 moves to collect 7 ticking time bombs. The ticking time bombs are set at 20, so that's not too bad. But look at this, this is where they come out and we've got chocolate. So I have to figure out the way around this and I don't know what that is yet. Now I've got two kinds of chocolate on the board. I've got this uh, dark chocolate and I've got milk chocolate spawners. The thing is they're two different varieties and so even if I take out dark chocolate, milk chocolate can still grow. Not very pleasant. I do however see that I've got some dispensers here. I'm going to try to figure out how to use those to set things off. I'm thinking if I can maybe, yikes, if I can open this up it's protected from chocolate, right? Maybe that will work. But there's so much to consider on this board. I'm also trying to stay in one particular area. So now here I'm going to make this stripe direct combo. It's going to hit a whole bunch of things, including these guys, and maybe make some effect down here. But then notice that with the licorice, there's a dispenser so that if I don't take out licorice on a turn, new licorice can show up. So that's not so good. Ooh, I'm going to move this wrapped candy over because wrapped candy over here will help to set this off, right? That's the plan. So there we go. We set that off. We're getting through there. So now we've got a ticking time bomb that is in isolation. Okay, it's not great, but we got something. Let's see if we can keep making fun things here. There we go. Oh, no, it hit the licorice. So I have to hurry up and hit this again, and I can't. Because like I said, it'll create problems for us. There we go. We got one. So now I see what I need to do. The question is, can I keep doing this? There we go, we're getting it. So it's working to focus on this right hand side. I still don't know that I'm going to get it done the first try, but at least I've figured out the mechanism to get it to work. So, oh, hello. Oh, hello, that's not good. Okay, sorry about that playing through Facebook is a bit of a difficulty. So I'm using the wrapped candies to help me bust through here. Well, that's probably not going to help, but I was left with three. So I just have to be more efficient in all that. And now that I understand it, I can start from the very beginning with that plan of using this right hand side and focusing just on this one spot here. So I'm going to pause the recording. I'll meet you back here with a new board and Hopefully we'll get this all done for you very soon, Beverly. Okay, so after a few turns, what I've noticed is these dispensers are stingy and we're not getting things right away. We're not getting wrapped candies coming down until about the third or fourth turn. So here we go. Now, of course, I need to get it together in the right spot. Let's do this and start things flowing. And now hopefully I'll get another one here soon, another wrapped. Oh, well that kind of created itself, didn't it? So let's just blow up a lot of stuff and keep trying to get this done in layers and layers. I could go wrapped again, although sometimes I think maybe stripe is better. Uh, ooh, if I could move that over, that would be wonderful. thinking I should maybe use this stripe here because I need to start taking out that licorice again. There we go. Look at that. That's beautiful. So taking out the licorice sets me up for when I can get something more generated here. Now I'm stuck. That's just how this goes sometimes. I can't make moves over here. That's why I say I'm stuck. I can't be where I want to be. All right. So we're unstuck but very few moves left and no wrapped candy showing up in time. Let's bring this down and then, oh, well, no, that was the end of my turns. <laughs> well, 
still not very close, but I'm going to leave this as an example because now that I've noticed that the dispensers are stingy, we have to get into the flow of it. We have to realize if it's only generating every third or fourth turn, we can try to make other moves until things work out. And hopefully next time I won't get stuck with no moves over here. I'll be right back with another attempt. All right, well, let's try to set up the green while we're waiting for something else to happen. And that worked out well, didn't it? Oh, my goodness. Well, I love that. I'm actually going to collect one of these right away. And I'm going to take this off right away. And I'm going to get rid of the licorice right away. So I think this is better than trying to do it bit by bit, like just taking out all blue. Although that might work. What if I do that? What if I just take out all blue? Because this really nets me only one bomb but the blue would net me a bomb and it would take out chocolate so this would still be preserved for one turn let's try this and see what happens and now I can take out oh now I can do this which hopefully will get me some chocolate gone as well and then I take out orange and that hits this because I can't take out purple or green so at least I've got the orange here, plus I've concentrated the colors down, right? And then I do this, which gets me another one. So yeah, I got a bit of luck on this one, huh? Then I do this. I'm watching all the portions of the board, even though this is where I want to, sh to you know, really target my efforts. If the board develops differently, I have to pay attention to how it's running. So uh, I would still like to get this open, but... It may not be the way this board goes. Yuck, I'm not liking any of my moves here now. Ah, oh, this is sad. I'm going to try to bring more orange into play. Oh, a wrapped wrapped combo would be good. I don't think I can get it, but I'm going to go striped wrapped. Clear things out. Here we go. Come on, wrapped candies down here. That's what I need now, is wrapped candies down here. There we go. That's that. Got it. All right. Well, you can see, Beverly, that there's skill and luck involved in this. I'm so glad I took the time to talk about the dispensers and showed you another failed attempt, because sometimes when we get extraordinary luck, and that's how we beat the board, it's hard to see the mechanism, but hopefully you were able to see the mechanism and then just pay attention to the board and what you're given uh, to try to get it all to come together. If this was helpful, I'd ask that you folks consider liking and subscribing. If you do have questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.